What's up, riders? Old Man Ronan here. Welcome back to the channel. <laughs> I tell you, this is going to be one exciting video. We're going to talk about the new uh, Royal Enfield concept bike, the SG650. Stay tuned. Well, what do you think of my studio? <laughs> Yeah, this is uh, something we don't normally do. We don't, don't normally do a studio shoot because, uh, you know, uh, I got cheapo Amazon lights and uh, I'm not sure how it's going to come out, but I, I think the red and blue vibe is going to be pretty cool because, uh, you know, if you notice the uh, the pre-video here at the intro, it that's kind of what their theme they were going for for this unveil was kind of like a purplish blue and uh, red. So, uh, we decided to do that. Use our cheapo lights and start this video off the right way. One of the reasons why I wanted to do this video was, uh, and why I called it the Sportster Killer is because I think Royal Enfield is doing all the right things. You know, uh, I've been riding Harley Davidsons for nearly 50 years. We're talking about next year will be 50 years, and uh, I'm telling you, uh, they just aren't listening to their uh, to their their consumers. As on the other hand, Royal Enfield listens and is doing everything they possibly can to grab more and more world market share. And especially here in America, this bike here, now even though it's just a concept, the I'm sure that the model will be called the Shotgun, that's what the SG I think is short for. But uh, we're gonna talk a little bit about it as we get into this video. Now, we're gonna switch over to a voiceover because I gotta show you some really cool pictures of this motorcycle. Royal Enfield's been the global leader in middleweight motorcycles for pretty much ever. Uh, anything from their 350s all the way up to the 650s now. And uh, I think that uh, they're going to be taking the world by storm with this new direction. They were saying that the, uh, the concept for the SG650 was a result of a challenge that uh, Royal Enfield's design team led by Mark uh, Wells, Chief of Design, to uh, transition into more of a, I think they describe it as a analog to digital combining the best parts of both. And you're seeing that right here. You know, I entitled this uh, video Sportster Killer because I'm telling you, there's a lot of similarities between this uh, particular bike and like a uh, Iron 883 and uh, maybe even some larger motorcycles that they have as well too. Like that front nasal, I think they're calling it a fairing, but it looks a lot like what comes on the Road King and some of the older models. And then you've got the solid wheels, the uh, billet uh, cut wheels, which I'm not sure will make the final... Um, cut if you will but it re reminiscent of fat boy uh, they have those type and then you're going to notice the bar end mirrors are underslung that i mean that's what everybody does with the sportster iron 83 and some of the other models as well too um, just everything about this bike screams we're going to come after you sportster and we're going to dominate you you know there's a lot of uh, really special parts of this motorcycle that's kind of brand new for Royal Enfield. Number one is that, uh, and we mentioned it earlier, the CNC aluminum uh, wheels. Uh, that's a big thing, again, reminiscent of the Fat Boy. But uh, they are ABS uh, integrated, and they also have dual brake calipers, which is really, really cool. In other words, you're gonna be able to have better control on your, on your braking. And one of the things I really like about this bike is the inverted front forks. I uh, That really adds a lot to the handling. This bike is going to perform well. If they do the things that uh, for the shotgun that they're doing on this uh, concept, it is going to be a, a bike to reckon with. I think it's really cool that they're using a floating uh, seat on it to give that bobber feel. But I'm sure that uh, down the road they'll offer a two-up version seat as well too because basically all they have to do is lay the seat pan down across and touch on the fender there and you basically have the Super Meteor, <laughs> if you will. But maybe this bike here, will the shotgun will be a single-seater. Who knows? Uh, again, this is just a concept, but it really, really, really has a, a beautiful look to it. I. Uh, the more I'm looking at it, the more I'd love to ride one and have one. <laughs> I want all the bikes. <laughs> you know, it's kind of fun. Concepts are, you know, ideas for the future. And a lot of motorcycles, uh, uh, when they uh, when they start pre-production, begin as a concept. And I'll tell you what, this thing here 
it, 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 it speaks to me because of, and again, you guys all know that my affiliation, I shouldn't say affiliation, my love of Harley Davidson, which actually led me to Royal Enfield because of the similarity I've talked about in other videos. Uh, but this is something that I think is really going to be, uh, <laughs> it's going to be a desirable bike. This bike will sell like mad in uh, America and actually North America. It is going to be on fire. That's, if it comes out, that's a prediction I'll make right here and now. Well, I really hope you enjoyed this video today. I know it's kind of, hey, what's that? What's that? <laughs> Guess what, guys? We're gonna extend the Old Man Ronin Fall T-shirt giveaway one more week. All you have to do is be a subscriber, comment below the time you saw Little Ronin run by, and also send me an email. That way I know exactly how to get a hold of you in case you are the winner. Last week's winner is... <laughs> Well, I really hope you enjoyed this video today. If you did, make sure you give us a big thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe. Hit that bell notification button. Share and comment. You know I read all the comments. And comment on as many as I possibly can. Tell you what, guys. This is going to be a really cool motorcycle. And the future of Royal Enfield looks brighter than you can ever imagine. Until next time, guys. Ride safe and keep her on two wheels, baby.